Come December 5th, there will be a new mayor here in New London and a new form of government, which means no more city manager. Now, whether or not Daryl Fenizio decides to use this office will be up to him. Everything, uh, As will many other things. With this election comes the return of the strong mayor form of government in New London. Because this is a new charter and a new government, all positions in the city of New London are technically vacant on December 5th as the new charter takes effect. So even those people who would be kept on in the new administration would need to be reappointed. Today, the mayor-elect met with the press outside his Ocean Avenue home with his transition team. Having moved to New London 18 months ago, he is a relative newcomer to the city and its politics, but he beat out five opponents, including three sitting city councillors. Throughout the campaign, we remained uh, aggressive in our uh, efforts, never took anything for granted. Uh, and are just very proud that we made it. Fenizio, who will be making $86,000 a year, has a lot of work ahead of him, looking at the heads of all departments, including police and fire. New London hasn't had a strong mayor for 90 years, which is reflected in the city council chambers, which shows the first city manager listed in 1921. Should any longtime city department heads be worried about their jobs? No, I believe that everyone should realize that we committed ourselves to a nonpartisan, merit based process. Another change with this new form of government is that, of course, there will be no longer a ceremonial mayor on the city council. Instead, a city council president will be sitting in the seat. On the scene in New London, Tina Detell, News 8.